Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back. Draft Day Sports Pro Football Episode uh, 3.4, Season 3, Episode 4. Uh, we are playing with the Dallas Cowboys. Uh, so I've been gone for the whole weekend. I uh, went and did uh, some family stuff uh, over the weekend. Just got home uh, this afternoon. Uh, a few hours ago, spent some time with the family, and then uh, wanted to come and do some entertainment for you guys. So uh, we're going to just jump right into it. So we're 5-1 and one after uh, six weeks of play. So let's go ahead and hop into uh, week seven, and we're going to see how we do. Uh, so simulate the week. Bam. Show the score. 31-17 win over the Seahawks. Uh, Wilson looks like he had a good game. Amari Cooper, player of the game. Five catches, 121 yards. No touchdowns. Uh, let's see. Prescott, 21 out of 35. 252, two touchdowns, a 101 rating. Elliott, 83 yards, 4.6 yards a carry. He had a touchdown. Pollard had a touchdown as well. And, uh, yeah, Cooper, the big receiver there. Wow. Four for 118 from Who's that? D, DK Metcalf. Ole Miss. Yeah. Oh, isn't that the dude? Two years. Isn't that the guy that got drafted this year that was like super ripped and they were worried about his agility and actual ability to run or move? <laughs> I was like, mm, okay. Uh, let's see. I'm seeing these news articles about coach extensions pop up, so maybe we need to pay some attention to that all right we've uh we've made a little bit of an offer to dak another one uh let's look at our staff and if you hear the baby real life people real life uh, let's see. He is signed for five years. These guys are signed for two, so we're okay there. I do have a lot of people I want to try to re-sign, but I kind of want Dak under contract before I worry about anybody else. All right, let's hop into this, and we're going to sim this week. Uh, we're off this week. Yes, we were. Nothing going on. Five emails. Oh. Morale is high. Wow, they are starting to really just jack me over with this contract. Uh, standings. There it is. All right, we're six and one. We've got a two game lead. We're going through week 12 this week, uh, this episode. So let's hop in. Uh, let's see. Show score. Ooh, man, the Colts blew us out. That's not fair. Andrew Luck retired, right? <laughs> man. I'm very disappointed about Luck having to retire. I, I really liked him as a player. Uh, he seems like a nice person to, to boot. Um, man, 21 out of 41. Not a good day for him. Three touchdowns for Luck. Cooper, 74 yards. That'd be a good week for you to accept my uh, contract offer. Not ready to make a decision. He is really jerking us around. Uh, let's see. Um, roster. Where it finances? No, that ain't what I want. Staff contracts, that's what I want. All right, so we've got an offer out to him. I'm going to let Randall Cobb go because I, I, I'm not going to pay 4 to $5 million for a number three receiver. Gallup's going to step into that role at a $1 million a year less. So we're good there. Uh, Quinn, 
Are you even playing? So you've played eight games. You've got one tackle and one sack. I like him, but I don't think I need to pay big money. Let me see what he wants. 2.1 for three years. Um, that's actually a pay cut. I'll offer that to him. All right. Uh, let's see. Who else? 30 years old. Eight starts. He's a three-year starter. He is 30 years old. 1.8. 2.3. Sure. That'll get him to 34. So we'll do that. Banderesh. I would like him. He's not he only started half the games this year, though. So he's at one point. Boy, he wants a raise to 3.1. Damn. Uh, tackling. Strength, agility. Two years. All right, I'll do that. That's actually a little less than I think it was a second ago, but we'll, we'll offer that. Uh, kicking distance, 91. 10 years, undrafted. 1.1. He only wants 570 for five years. Do I want him for five years? That's 37 years old. Uh, can I drop that to four? All right. Michael. He he. Michael Jackson. He's a starter. 690 he wants 2.4 oh my god that's the agility's pretty solid hmm I think I'm going to go with another kicker next year. I don't know why. Sharp. That's, yeah, see, he's actually, I think he's going to be okay, but only signing him to that one-year contract. That's going to be, uh, all right, he's the backup. Uh, I want to sign him to a four-year deal, but I don't want to pay him that much. I want to pay him about... A million and a half. And I think he turned something down like that before. So if that's the case, I may have to let him go. All right. Ship's going to be there. Scott. Rodriguez. Yeah, we're going to let him go. Roberge. Isn't he on the uh, practice squad? Yeah. Two years at 890. Can I get two years at 670? All right. That'll be enough for this week. <laughs> That's a lot of, lot of contracts that I'm not going to remember what we offered anyway. All right. We're playing Jacksonville. Oh, 
another loss. Ugh. Is that Paxton Lynch? I believe it is. They had six first downs and won the game. Six first downs and won the game. We only scored on a defensive touchdown. Uh, did Prescott get hurt? Ooh, and Sharp had a horrible game. Two picks. All right, we need to go... Uh, Player report, performance. Yeah. All right, Chris Jones signed the contract. All right, so Keith Sharp's going to be a free agent, and Roberge will be a free agent. All right, um, roster. Dak, broken leg, ouch. Well, that may end our season. That could be it. All right, so we're going to need to go into depth chart. Um, oh, wait, roster, roster management. He's out four to six weeks. So if it's six weeks, that would, that would get him back week 17. He might come back for the playoffs. So we kind of have to keep him on the team. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to move to active. That's Roberge. Then I'm going to release him. Then I'm going to have to go to free agency. And I only want quarterbacks. Sort by accuracy. Arm, accuracy, intelligence. Oh God, I just, I don't know if I could bring myself to sign Josh McCown. We could sign Michael Vick. He's 41 years old. Sean Hill, he's still in here? Holy crap. I guess they just don't want to retire. We'll just stay on just in case. <laughs> uh, let's just check the OVR. I know that's not supposed to be the best way. So yeah, let's go to accuracy again. Jeremiah Evans from Louisiana Tech. Arm, accuracy, endurance. All right. Um, I'm going to sign him to the active squad. All right, then we'll close that, go to the depth chart, and then we will do go. Well, you cannot play him, I am afraid. All right, that's odd. That shouldn't happen, I don't think. But that's all right. I wonder if he'll still play. Uh, defensive coordinator. All right, let's see what happens this week just for fun. Uh, simulate week, Dallas and Philly. Cowboys have too many players on the active roster. Are you kidding me? Uh, roster. Roster management. Oh. 
So I cleared the practice squad, but I did not move another guy over. I gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. All right. Uh, Scott. Stats. Three games. I think I'm going to have to move him to the practice squad. There we go. All right. So let's go back to here and finish simulating the week. Let's go back up. Show the score. We lost. That's too bad. Moment of truth. All right. He did not play. Sharp actually had a good game. Three touchdowns. Wow. 80-yard pass. Blake Jarwin, Randall Cobb, 16-yard pass. That's not bad. Elliott had a decent game, five yards a carry. All right. Oh, I, <laughs> Prescott, I better sign while I, before I get cut. Robert Quinn signed. Let us just say that nothing in there made him use his indoor voice. Oh, that's hilarious. I guess we're going to lose Van Der Esch too. All right, week 12. We'll finish up here. Thirteen to ten, we got a victory. There's not a whole lot there to be happy with. Seventeen out of thirty-six, yeah, that's not good. I don't want to pay you starter money for that. Olafont, five catches to lead the team. Cooper, only one catch. Wow. All right, uh, well, emails, nothing. Nothing of importance there. Let's check our standings. All right, so Lions 9 and 2 running away with the North. Falcons 10 and 1. They've had they've, they've got the division clinched, right? We're 7 and 4, still nursing a two-game lead. Luckily everybody else is below 500, kind of like real life. And the Rams, 7-4, and four, they're fighting that out tough. Over in the American, oh, that's brutal. Oh, that whole division sucks this year. Colts and Jags, Texans, wow. wonder if we could get, hmm, uh, Chargers are 8-3. and three. Might get two wild cards out of the South there with the Colts winning right now, but the Jags, Texans are both within striking distance. That's going to be a fun first round game. Steelers 4 and 7 lost 5 in a row. Jets are 7 and 4. Only two games separate everybody. Patriots at 500. Chiefs Chargers 8 and 3. Broncos at 1 and 0. Oh. All right, we are 13th in scoring offense, 15th in yardage, 8th rushing, 24th passing. Defense ranks number four overall. There we go on the leaderboard, number 11 against uh, the uh, total yardage, number 19 rushing, and number seven against the pass. I wonder why, I wonder why they have them in this order here, and then it's passing and then rushing here. Just wondering. Curious. All right. Yeah, she's talking. All right, so we will pick, come back next episode. I'm going to go in, look at some more players. Uh, need to take a look at... We're at $73 million for next year. It doesn't tell me what the... Player, uh, the salary cap is. Uh, I guess if I go into roster management, it might. No, not at all. Cool. Uh, where was I at again? Yeah, contracts. There we are. Um, all right, so. I may give Van Der Esch another shot, and then I need to kind of go through the rest of these guys. Lamar's 34. I'm going to let him go. 
Malik Collins, has he played any? He's actually started eight games. 34 tackles, four for loss, two forced fumbles. Yeah, we'll submit that offer. That's Malik Collins there. Covington. There, he's been a two-year starter, so we probably need to keep him. 598 2 million for three years. Let's do that. And Cooper Rush. Accuracy is not bad. Leadership, work ethic. I mean, honestly, what is he, just out of curiosity, what's he going to ask for? He's making 540 right now. He only wants 450. You know what? Yes. For a backup, sure. I really like that other quarterback, but I just don't I don't see paying him that much money. I'm gonna go through the rest of these guys. Uh, Branch is gonna go free agent. I'm gonna check the other guys here. Wise Awuzie. Um I think Mar I'm gonna let go. So we'll check these other guys. Uh, so we'll see you guys next episode. Hit the like button, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. And uh, we will talk to you later. Have a good one. Bye.